the Sport World Championship this weekend. Lorenzo Baldassari on the number seven, and he's just mugged away. Oh. Can be a big moment for Baldassari. He almost collects Dominic Egerton. The two of them are now going to race to the flag. Lorenzo Baldassari has made the save of the century and saves the first race victory of 2022 as well. Baldassari victorious. Sorry, and Dominic Egerton, what a final corner. Yeah, you can see there the massive moment for Balda on the number seven machine. Somehow manages to keep himself on it and then able to still get the bike picked up to look at that and manages Balda. to knock Dominic Egerton offline as well two for one yeah the really impressive stuff there from Balda great shot all the viewers yeah. <laughs> well it is six laps to go as we see uh, uh, the to me to you Barry Chuck oh, oh. There, and that was a great save from Fuertes Sound the number 20 I do always wonder, are we being too sort of Machiavellian in believing they're really having these master plans? Hmm. Or is it largely just... Oh, oh wow, what a save oh, from no. Pratama! Oh, my goodness, that's sensational. I mean, he's got a pretty small frame. How he managed to hold on to that? Oh, this knee slider, look at goodness this. Goodness me. So you think, oh, he's off, and then you think, oh, he saved it. But no, and he's then, still not quite back on again, the bike. But you can see there, I think that is because he's, he's a smaller frame rod. I mean, that's not a problem he's going to have. With uh, on the guys ahead of him, he's trailing Albert Reynas. This was him. Oh, you're running the race. Oh, Baltus! <laughs> Look at Barry Baltus. Take a bow, Baltus. How on earth did he get on the podium late on here in Qatar? He's won wide oh! though. Oh, a girl lost How the did front. He stay up? A girl lost the front. Can you believe it? And that looks like Sam Lowe's will take third place. Lowe's comes to the finish line. V is for Vietti. V is for. Victor. Here we go. I agree. You can see the front end oh. going there. And Augusto Fernandez, blissfully unaware of what's about to hit him. Yeah, he's there that, it is him, and up he goes. Augusto Fernandez loses a podium but saves Ayagurma's Grand Prix. Can you believe it? I've never seen anything Contract. looks like you might be able to just be able to do that as they get to the top of the hill oh this is good stuff I think we may be having a little COC hearing after this as well, which we might get wind of. Oh, maybe not. Not if Steven Fields doing that. Woohoo! Sideways. A massive wobbly wicks at the top end of the field there. That is for sure for Steven Creel. As he gets it completely lit up into turn five. He came in there way. Marcelinho, Thiago Godoy. E Thiago Godoy. Olha o Marcelinho, rapaz. Segura, segura para lá. Se me deu a impressão que parece que estava caindo um pouco de combustível na hora, que é o que acontece. We were chatting there, we noticed on the totem, James Moffat has been able to get by Michael Caruso. Oh. Moffat up to second, Jordan Cox, what a save! What a save! Contact at the final turn, good save. So again, there'll be a call out to race control and how the... É por isso que vai para adelante, Morillo. En esta vuelta fue el más rápido de los cuatro de adelante. Ahí van los cuatro primeros cuando entra en un dibujo Ay, raro. Pavón. Luis Pavón, que zafa cuando se metía de nuevo a la pista. Y zafaron todos los que ven. What has happened to the number 89? Is he on the curbs as well? Oh, on the white line. Slippery as you like. Look at this. He's on the curb, on the white line, and how on earth has he stayed on board that? That kicked sideways. Behind him, we're going to see what's happened to Paul. Oh, he's oh, touched the whoa. white line and he's gone way off track. Wow, that was a monumental scare for Paul Espargaro. The wow. inside line, bike 22 coming in there is John Emerson in Guito. So Indonesia, Malaysia, oh. Philippines. Somebody had a save. big one. What a save. That's one of the, uh, the Yamaha, uh, the Uber What happens here? Oh, slams on the brakes nearly high side comes off the bike foot down on the floor Barry yeah and back up again that it's damage limitation now for uh, for the defending champion whatever happened we've got confirmation oh! Oh! sorry about that to uh, scare everybody that was huge that was huge for Anthony have you ever seen anything like this in international racing? Maziato gets it wrong. He hits the wall and he hits the fellow Aprilia. Hayden Schultz also gets hit two or three times. So I think the planning for the uh, the final lap will uh, start as we go across the oh! line. Tommy Edwards, massive.
massive, massive money. No, there's an issue. Flat, he's got a flat tyre. No, that, there's that, an issue there for that, sure. That yep. flat. Oh, it's yeah. pumped up there. It looks like he's had some sort of uh, massive decompression right at that point there, and he's managed to ride it out. He still thinks he just hit us something. He's on the gas. It won't recover. Flat tyre. Look at how disappointed he is there. He should see him right at the back on the 167. I want to show you, oh, I want to show you something happened just a moment ago in his rookie year. Oh, well, look out, look out, look out. Hold on to it. Just when we said all they need to do is cruise, Kevin Morans gets way out of shape. Yeah, we talked about first rhythm section. Goes, oh, look at, yeah, just almost like the rut grabbed him, almost takes out a robo cam. Three nice or, save, three or though. Four never, tough never hit the ground. Oh. Just a little bit. Yeah, he goes sideways. Probably hit the rut. Just off balance. There you go. That's Supercross 3D. I know. That was. <laughs> that's some great camera work. Attacker counter pass. He set Eli Tomac up perfectly. Swung out wide, then went back. Oh, oh, oh. massive tank slapper from Tomac. Oh, How man. did he stay on? I don't know, but I bet Alpha Coulthard drives it down the middle of the road to cover off Jordan Cox, who I don't think is going to take though for an answer. They are three wide. This oh, is going to be no. And that was coming a mile away. Hansen is off. He'll straighten the car up, but lose a ton of positions in the process. How will Motorsport Australia... It's the Yamaha that leads of Tim Neath from the BMW in FHO colours of Alex Olsen and then two Hondas. Oh, oh God, big, big blimey, big blimey, 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 around Woodcote Corner. Oh, massive, just too much, a little bit too much for his Rollo. Have a little look, watch his back tyre here. Remember, this is 140, 150 miles an hour, steps out now. Look at the oh. smoke coming off it. Oh, my word, that was huge. Swing, just look at the slow-mos here. And the last oh. chicane, I tell you what, it doesn't come <laughs> much closer than that here at Arsene in the last oh. chicane. And just as he thought, he just had enough. Now that Ducati's protesting again, you don't get too much more protesting than that before the bike disagrees with you fully. That was three moments. It's really right now, so uh, the Simpsons also have a good weekend this weekend. Is that through turn two? Oh, oh, there's oh, so we go. That's Nelson. I don't know how he's managed to save that team. Can he keep the bike upright? He's done a sensational job to keep that bike upright. Oh, no, you know what he needs to do now. Well, let's, let's hope he grabs, grabs those, those brake pads, pads to make sure that they're still there. there. The view that Liam Waters had of it. Uh, he got perfect view. I reckon he's probably just thinking, where's he going to crash so I can try and avoid it? Everyone's had to sit up and avoid the carnage. That's, that is lucky to get away with that.